All right, guys. So today I'm going to reveal the one item that is the best for me personally when it comes to an emergency quick fix when I get cramps in my calves or in my feet. That's where I get them. I don't really get them in my thigh, but my calves and my feet. So at the end of this short video, I'll reveal to you what it is. But this is um, what I currently, some of the products we currently use. Uh, let's just go through real quickly. Do your own research, please. I don't in specifically endorse any of these, um, but do your own research. This is just what works for me. Bananas, I eat this in the morning, half a day, uh, half a banana, um, once a day. That's, that's great for potassium. On the topic of, of potassium, can't speak today. I use this potassium supplement. I take, uh, I think uh, the directions say four a day or something like that, two to four times. Anyway, read the directions, and I use this. I, t I personally take four a day um, for maintenance to keep me, prevent me from getting cramps. Uh, let's go to Gatorade. Everyone knows what this. I use Gatorade Zero because uh, I don't need extra sugar. <clears throat> but sometimes when I'm going into a workout that I know is um, maybe beyond an hour, like uh, maybe a two-hour workout. Or, um, this is a, a, a dance or a fitness um, or skating type workout. I will actually drink this, uh, start drinking it before the workout and during. Um, now, if I have time and I want to mix something, and I get, I, sometimes I just want to mix it up so I don't get tired of this. I use this. This is a, uh, it's called Drip Drop. I get it on Amazon, dehydration relief fast. I use this again before or during and just like you put it into a bottle of water, shake it up, and it's ready in an instant. So this is, again, stuff I use to prevent cramps from happening. Uh, in the liquid form, powdered liquid, kettle form. This, I will not take this unless I know it's a particularly heavy day, maybe a couple hours of practice, um, or for performances. I would take, definitely take one of these in the morning of the performance, maybe one during the performance, but this is, there's several different varieties. They taste pretty much terrible. So different degrees of, of terrible, but I don't take this every day. It does get expensive. I don't take it every day, um, but it has a bunch of electrolytes in it, usually the ingredients. Uh, and again, I take this usually when it's a particular, particularly heavy day or when I'm trying to recover uh, from a heavy day and I feel kind of crampy, all right? So this is homeopathic herbal. Well, I don't have the ingredients here, but you can look it up. I used to use this. I tried it, and it seemed to work for a while, but Erin really likes this. She uses this um, regularly, so there's stuff like this. This one says quick, quick acting, yeah, tablets. So there's stuff like this out there. It's homeopathic, herbal, so um, it's, prob it's, you know, it's probably safe uh, and, and uh regular quantities, not, nothing too excessive. Now this is something that a dancer, a friend of mine, um, shared with me, and it did work initially. But for some reason, it stopped working. So during uh, a moment of cramping, I would go ahead and suck on this, we want to, and instantly the, cramp, the cramps would go away. I'm not sure what the mechanism is behind it, but it did, it did work. And then, Maybe my body got used to it and stopped working. So I don't use this anymore, but you can consider trying mustard. Maybe it has something to do with a really strong um, taste, which kind of like sends a shock to your nervous system and releases the uh, contractions in your muscles. I don't know specifically uh, what the mechanism is. I did once, but I looked it up and I forgot. So I don't use this anymore. Karen doesn't use this. Let's see what they have recovered. Uh, this one's just recovery. Branch chain amino acids are great for really heavy workouts, several hours long, when I know the next day I'm going to be super sore. So if I know I'm going to be super sore, I'll take this immediately after the workout. One, one packet. Again, dump it in water, swish it around, and it'll be ready, um, ready to drink. And if it's a particularly uh, intense workout, and the next day I know I have to keep going, I don't, I don't have a day of rest, I might take two of these. <laughs> okay, so that leads me to, I think I covered everything. Yes, I love this. Um, tonic water, you may know uh, about tonic water. 
has a special ingredient in it that says right here, quinine. Uh, quinine is actually used to treat malaria, um, but the doses that are contained here in tonic water are very small and safe. Um, you know, if you don't drink this every day. And I don't, I use this for emergencies or when I, you know, when I feel cramps coming on or maybe if I'm doing my seven minute program. Yes, I have a seven minute program off the ice, a dance program, it's crazy. And um, I do that, I compete that several times a year. So during competition, I might take this right before. I don't wait till I get cramps. But I have it in this scenario where I got cramps, maybe I'm doing a spin, and as I'm pulling in, the force, um, the centrifugal force, causes my calf, the leg, the leg to out, to cramp really hard, and it hurts so so bad. Um, but um, I'll take, I'll drink one of these tonic waters, and it takes it away instantly. It's amazing. It's truly amazing. Um, again, I don't do this regularly, so I don't, I don't want to build up a tolerance to it. Um, I use this for those type of emergencies and also for competitions where I know I'm, maybe I'm competing and showcase potentially eight programs. I might take this halfway through. So these days, I don't wait till I get cramps, but I'll anticipate it. And again, this is good for performance days, competition days. I don't take it regularly. Um, and emergencies, and I haven't had a lot of emergencies, many emergencies at all recently, um, except if I'm, you know, maybe I'm, I'm staying up all night and drinking coffee or some sodas with caffeine, and it's causing me to, you know, to urinate or to lose a lot of water and dehydrate. Uh, the next day, I, I could drink this, but I try to save this just for emergencies and for competitions because um, this is this is like gold to me. So um, there's many kinds out uh, there's there's some brands out there. It doesn't matter what what you get. There's there's some that are diet or sugar, uh, zero sugar in this case or regular, and it's safe because you know it's used in cocktails, gin tonic. Um, it's slightly sweet, uh, and um, I love this. So right here. This is the secret, the quick fix uh, for emergency cramps in your legs. Give this a try sometime. Let me know what you think. Um, comment below. Please be sure to smash that subscribe button. And I'll see you in the next video.